Hey, what is up, YouTube? Gem Wolf here, and I am pretty excited to bring you guys to a um, tutorial, which I'm gonna be doing about one every single week, and yeah, and like I don't want to go over my schedule during this tutorial, but yeah. So I I have actually found that the tutorials on the best settings for ScreenFlow 4.5 or just 4.0, none, nothing lower. Like I find like all the tutorials that have the best export settings are not the best, to be honest. Um, if anything, the ones that that you probably see nowadays are like the update for 3.0 or, or lower, in indeed. Well, like maybe for all we know, the beta. <laughs> I don't know, but um. So yeah, today we're going to be going over the best export settings. So um, you guys don't see right now the uh, screen flow edit and all that stuff, my name and all that stuff, since I don't want you guys seeing that uh, for just for person, like I don't want any hackers or I don't know, but yeah. So you want to click up here on file, then go all the way down to export. So then this thing will pop up and you might be thinking, okay, it's, it says web and then dash high. I'm guessing that that's the best one. No. What you need to do is go down to loose list, then click customize, and then over here you can really just mess around with all of this. Since, I mean, I would recommend um, choosing right over here. Let me just first find it. Um, how about this? I'm not going to be doing it, but go with the one that that go with the one that you are using currently. But now, now for all those people who don't know what these numbers are, <laughs> it's normal. It's okay. Um, but um, I would recommend like doing it from here to all the way here. Since this is going to be 1080p at 30 frames a second, which is the average, we're going to be doing this, and we don't want, no, we want 30 frames a second, god, and then click OK, then what we want to do is not go to sound, since the sound is just fine how it is, we're going to be going down to scale to custom size, click this, and then put these two numbers in. Put um, 1920 in the width and 1080 at the height. This will make it full on 1080p. Um, but and down here, you guys don't really need to do this motion blur. But yeah, so that was kind of the quick tutorial. But now I'm going to be telling you guys a little downfalls about this. One of the downfalls about doing this is the fact that when you kind of mess around with the settings, um, it switches the video up. Which makes the which makes the computer having to do more stuff, which is just a complete waste of time since it actually doesn't switch. It just makes you think that it is, and it tries as hard as it can, but it just can't since the recording is is put at a default to that. Like what you guys see in the background here, that is complete. Um, that's how it would look like at the best set at the best export setting, which is what this is. Um, export settings, which is this what this is. And yeah, so another downfall, the files are for this are huge. Um, well, I use this for Minecraft and Hounds of, well, I use this for Minecraft and Hounds Adventure, and I would get a file size of 64 gigabytes. Yes, you heard me correctly, 64 gigabytes for about a 20, in between a 20 to a 30 minute video. So I'd recommend using these settings only for videos up to 15 minutes, and now you're really pushing the limit since even 15 minutes, you can even get to about 30, yeah, 30, um, 30 gigabytes. So it is a lot, but it is worth it since it's very good. Now, please do note that when I did Apple HDD, but this thing right here, let me just go Back. Wait, no, not this. No, dude. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? You need to go down to customize settings, and then here. This I um I didn't really. I don't ever really switch since technically, um, since technically, uh, really when you're really working with any type of computer, there's always some type of animation happening. So I'll just recommend leaving it at this compression type of animation. And um, you guys can also do this data rate thing. Um, I don't know how to unlock it since I just never have used it. And also here, we want this compressor. I forgot to be at the best. The 
like I said, the best. <laughs> and you want millions of colors plus, then click OK, OK. And then you want to do the beautiful thing of this magical export button. And then you'll end up getting a file size pretty big. So, um, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. And I'm sorry about uploading not on Friday nights, but on Saturday morning. It's because I had some stuff to do Friday nights. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Please leave a thumbs up. It really does um, leave a huge amount of support. And also, don't forget to click subs that, that subscribe button if you haven't already. And please join the, the, the Wolf Pack. It, it would be really amazing to have another one of you guys in. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Peace. Destruction.